Good morning, fourth grade. It is 4B co-teacher Mr. Romano here coming at you with day two of our positivity project character trait of the week purpose. Yesterday, we watched a great video of Les Brown, motivational speaker, talking about finding your purpose in life, right? Finding your dreams and making sure you do what you have to do to make sure you attempt to make your dreams become a reality. So if we take a look ahead. Connection purpose, you have beliefs about the meaning of your life and your life's purpose. You seek to be a part of something greater than yourself. I said this yesterday, it's almost equivalent to being on a team. Anytime you're on a sports team, anytime you're part of any team, right? The goal is to win and obviously it takes a lot of individual talent to win, but it also takes a lot of teamwork, camaraderie, working well with others. Maybe somebody you may not be friends with, off the field or off the court and putting aside your differences for something greater than yourself, right? And that's what having purpose is. So I want you guys to watch this video. Any of those times could have been the last time I danced, had my bone completely snapped. Did anybody know you were hurt? No, definitely not. Why did you do it? I was 29 years old and I was really given the biggest role of my career at that point. And I felt had I not done this performance and proven myself that I was capable and mature enough to become this character, that I wouldn't be given the opportunity again. See, you hate waking up because you're waking up and you don't know the reason. You're waking up and you don't have no design in mind. Once you live in your purpose, when you discover your gift, you can't wait to wake up. You wonder why you do it and, and if you don't love it you won't survive because it is hard work people say you you have to have a lot of passion for what you're doing and the reason is because it's so hard that if you don't any rational person would give up i found an empty space where i could just put on music and leave you've got to find what you love what burns in your heart is important for you to pay attention to because it never goes away. Since college is a period of discovery, what I suggest to all college students is you spend a lot of time discovering your gift. If you wake up pursuing your math, you're going to have a rough life. That's why people wake up in a rut. Their life has no purpose, no meaning. They, they're not morning people. I'm just not a morning person. You're not a morning person because you, you're not living in your purpose. Talking to somebody that had flipped his life completely upside down. Pay very close attention to the thing that makes you happy. You can go ahead and pursue your math degree, and there's nothing wrong with getting it. But also take a look at what burns on the inside. You've got to look at your dreams, man. I dreamed of being on TV since I was 10 years old. I was told I'd never be on TV. I didn't get on TV till I was 38. Boy, when I got there, once I got on TV on Showtime with the Apollo, I've been on TV every since. And if you turn your television on today, I'm on TV every single day. If you don't love it, you're going to fail. Your work is going to fill a large part of your life. And the only way to be truly satisfied is to do what you believe is great work. And the only way to do great work is to love what you do. Pay very close attention to the thing that makes you happy. Look at what burns on the inside. You've got to look at your dreams, man. I didn't get on TV till I was 38. Or when I got there. Once I got on TV on Showtime, I've been on TV ever since. Do not ignore the thing that burns in you. What burns in your heart is important for you to pay attention to because it never goes away. Fantastic video. 
So I have some questions for you guys. How does Misty Copeland work towards her purpose in life? The ballerina in the, in the video we watched. How are purpose and perseverance related? They are intertwined. How does discovering your gift and what you love help you live your life better? What does the phrase burn in your heart mean? Do you believe we can have more than one purpose? The purpose of life is to be happy. Now, a lot of great quotes were said in this video. I, I love this video. It, it takes me back to when I was training, playing football. You have to understand if you don't love what you do, you'll find any excuse to not do it, right? So no matter what you do, from when the moment you wake up to the moment you go to sleep at night, you have to work on what you want. You have to be passionate. You have to put in the time and effort. If you want to go to college, you need to put in the work and study, do good in school, all the way up until you get into college and then do good in college and continue on to your career. If you want to be a professional basketball player, professional football player, okay, you need to do amazing in school because otherwise you won't be on the team, but you need to find time to put in the work on the court, off the field, on the field, off the court. You have to find time for the things that you want to do. If you're passionate about them, you'll find time. You won't find excuses. Find your purpose in life. I love and miss you guys. I cannot wait to see you back in the classroom. Ciao.